Hello, my name is Renata. I'm a self-sponsored person project manager at Baltic Aviation Academy. Today, I would like to tell you more about App Initio programs and provide you more helpful information which will guide you in determining which of the programs suits your needs better. The first and foremost thing that you should do is to distinguish what is your goal, whether you would like to obtain a commercial pilot license or engage in combined bachelor degree and commercial pilot license studies. But in order to do that, let me give you some additional information so you can make a well-informed decision. Let's start from the beginning. So you are interested in becoming a pilot. That's great, because we have two different programs to offer you. It is either CPL Modular or ATPL Integrated. Let's look which of them suits your needs better. CPL Modular, also known as Commercial Pilot License Modular Course, is mostly suitable for people who have no previous experience or knowledge in aviation field. This course starts from absolute zero and is divided into modules. It is perfect for people who are working or have other activities. This course can be started as early as 16 years old. Let's take a closer look of the course design. You would start from private pilot license PPL theory, which totals up to 155 hours and is divided into nine subjects which you must cover. The first part of the course also includes 47 hours of flights under the visual flight rules. First stage of the course will approximately take a year to accomplish. With the start of the second year, ATPL Integrated Theory course begin. It's a much broader and in-depth course that is combined of 14 subjects and takes 620 hours of ground school to complete. During the second and the third year of the CPL modular course, you will continue performing flights under the visual flight rules in Technam 2002 aircraft. Course also includes training in the Flight Navigation Procedures Trainer, FNPT. This is where you will learn how to manage an aircraft using only instruments. Once you have passed all the necessary exams and acquired enough flight experience, you will continue training with Cessna 172 aircraft. This stage will also include visual night flights. The last step in your flight tower building is flights with the multi-engine aircraft Technam 2006. So to sum it all up, the way CPL modular program works is that once you get your license after the first year, then you keep on adding different modules once you pass them. So for example, you completed your VFR, IFR and ME flights and it will be added to your license one by one until you complete all the CPL modular courses. After three years of studies, according to CPL modular program, you will achieve commercial pilot license issued according to YASA requirements. ATPL Integrated, it's a lot more concentrated in-depth course. It requires students to have a deeper knowledge in English, math and physics, as from the early beginning it's quite intensive. The specifics of the ATPL Integrated course are that it cannot be divided into models as previously analyzed CPL modular course. The entire course needs to be completed in two years of period. Also, ATPL candidates cannot be younger than 18 years old. Studies start with ATPL theory, which consists of 14 different subjects and takes 770 hours to complete. In between the courses, you will have the visual and the instrumental flights in single-engine Technam 2002 and Cessna 172. Later, you will also fly with the heavier multi-engine aircraft Technam 2006. The last stage of the program is the multi-crew cooperation course, where you will have a chance to train in the real full flight simulator Airbus A320 or Boeing 737 in order to master the skills of the communication between the crew. The third option is to pick a program which will give you two career opportunities. Combined Aviation Management and Pilot License Study Program is meant for those who are aiming to acquire a pilot license and a degree in Aviation Management. 
as well as to start a career in a global and dynamic aviation field. Duration of the combined studies is only three and a half years. As a result, you will graduate with two specialities, higher education diploma and license of the commercial pilot. In order to enter this program, you need to have a secondary or higher education diploma. You will also need a document which certifies that you have passed TOEFL, EELS or other English language proficiency test. So how those two programs can be combined together? The first year is identical to the studies of the private pilot license that we talked about in the commercial pilot license part. And in addition to the pilot license classes, you will also be attending aviation management classes. You will spend three days in a week at Kazimierz Simonowicz's University for aviation management and two days at Baltic Aviation Academy for private pilot license studies. The flight time will also be planned accordingly to shuttle in your time at the university. The second and the third year of pilot license studies, which will be identical to ATPL integrated theory training, will also be combined with the aviation management classes at the university. Not to mention, during the three and a half years of studies, you will be provided with three different internship positions at the different aviation companies. This will give you a better grip of the aviation industry and help you learn. So after three years, you will receive CPL module license and another half a year later, your aviation management bachelor degree diploma. This have been short and hopefully helpful overview of three different programs to engage in. Always keep in mind that whichever you will choose, it will take your time and dedication. And if at any point you will feel lost, don't hesitate and contact us for more information. That's it for now and see you soon in next video.